you may disagree with this. That is okay. Whatever. <laughs> you may disagree with this, but whatever. And I can be wrong about this. Hey, I can be wrong about this. Kev can be wrong about this. Okay. We both can agree that we are going to reap whatever we sow. Meaning, when you do evil, evil is going to come back upon you. When you do good, good is going to come back upon you. Okay, listen. I believe this, and I can't be wrong. Kev can be wrong about this, but I don't think I am. Even when you begin to serve God, I believe, and I can be wrong about this, that you are still going to reap based upon the bad things that you have done when you were in sin. I am telling you. And you may say, why do you say that, Kevin? Okay, listen. Even with myself, I am out of sin now. Even though I am out of sin now, the many bad things or some bad things that I did back when I was in sin, as it seems, they come against me now. Like, for instance, I used to have sex before marriage so much and do other sexual things so much so much <laughs> so much even though i don't mess around like that anymore that stuff still tries to find a loophole or some type of entry to enter back in i am telling you I am telling you, and other things as well. Other issues that I had back then, even though I don't mess around like that anymore, tries to come against me still. Even though I quit that stuff. I have nothing to do with that stuff anymore. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> it still comes against me anyhow. Listen, back when I was in sin, I was really rotten, <laughs> arrogant, conceited, cocky, overly confident, hypocritical, narcissistic, I guess you can say, and so many more bad characteristics. Yes, I was prideful as well. So I can see pride in others because I used to be so prideful. So prideful, man. Crazy, man. And I used to treat some people, some people, not all. I used to treat some people in a very mean way. Now that I serve God, sometimes some people treat me in that same way or similar to it. The way that I used to treat people. Payment must be made. Yes, you may be out of sin now, Yes, but payment must be made. I am telling you, and you may say, Kevin, I hear you, but what does that have to do with me? Listen, you may believe that everything 
is cool with you now. You may believe that, hey, I am young, Kevin. I still have about whatever, so many years to go before I get serious. Listen, everything is adding up. Everything is adding up. So while you are believing this live fast, die young, or this you only live once mess, <laughs> I am telling you, man, everything is adding up. <sighs> Payment must be made. Listen, I regret all the sinful things that I did in the past. I regret it because the closer I get to God, the more I see that those things hurt me and they still, how can I say that? It still, I guess you can say plagues my life still. I guess you can say that. Crazy. Even when I don't do that stuff anymore. Somehow that stuff is, or those demons, I guess you can say, still try to find entry because I opened the door back then. <laughs> I am telling you. I am telling you. So while you are believing that everything is fun and games now, listen, this stuff is going to come against you perhaps your whole life. Close those doors. Don't play in witchcraft. Don't have sex before marriage. I am telling you, man, sex before marriage may seem like, hey, <laughs> a very small thing. It is not. It is not. Just wait until you want to serve God. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Just wait until you want to serve God. Then you are going to see that that small thing is not so small. It is really, really crazy. Really, really crazy. So let me stop here. God bless you.